Thanks for choosing this tutorial. Today, we'll be covering the text and dimension style icons in DraftSight. Both features work to quickly make your designs appear uniform and allow you to customize your labeling to align with the branding style of your company. They do this by presetting your personalized text and dimension styles so they instantly embody your preferences when inserted. Both icons are located in the annotate section of the ribbon. After selecting the text style icon, an options menu will open. Press the new icon to name your text. And then customize your text font, format, height, and orientation. Then press OK. Now that you've created a new style, when you insert any type of text, you can quickly use that format as many times as you want. The dimension style icon opens the same type of option window, prompting you to name your new style and personalize it to your liking. The dimension choices are a bit more extensive and allow you to add more detail to your labeling. For example, I found myself using the dual dimensions tab quite often because it allows you to add in a suffix like centimeters or whatever measurement you're using and even tailor your dimension to have formats like architectural or engineering. Likewise, the text settings allow you to choose your dimension's textile and position relative to their entities. I especially like to frame my dimension's text because I found that it enhances the clarity and precision of my designs. Keep in mind that in order for DraftSight to set your personalized styles as the default, you must press the activate icon located in the top right corner before pressing OK in the text dimension style options windows. I hope this encourages you to create your own text and dimension styles. If you're looking to learn more, visit the blog page or visit draftsite.com.